Hello guys, this is Brian with my order video. My order from Electrician, uh, da, Vin da Vinci, and uh, Lollicup came all at the same time. Two came from UPS and one came from FedEx, and FedEx came right after UPS did this morning. Uh, so I'm going to start off with my Nutrition order. For those who do not know what Nutrition is, it's like a supplement type of store, which they carry all, carry all kinds of food stuff too. Um, bariatric food, which is sugar-free and low-carb stuff, uh, sugar-free foods, um, all kinds of stuff. Um, so you may want to check them out, and they do offer a flat rate, no matter how much you order, four dollars and ninety-five cents. And then, uh, and I think if you live in New Jersey, they do sell uh, charge sales tax, but other than that, they don't anywhere else. So the first product I got is uh, Dixie Diner. Dixie Diner is a uh, low carb food. Uh, they have bread mixes, cereal, um, bacon mixes, soups, cake mix, uh, all kinds of stuff. And they're actually located in Texas, Tumball, Texas. And their website is dixiediner.com. If you want to check them out, you can order from them directly. But on Nutrition, their stuff is cheaper on nutrition.com. So actually, the order I got, it came from Texas, went to New Jersey, and came back to Texas because <laughs> it was at Nutrition's Warehouse. But the first product is um, Bakes Quick Mix, just similar to um, Bisquick, but much better for you. On here, they consider this as a, a one-pound bag, 45 servings, but they consider serving as a biscuit, um, I guess. 21 calories, 2 net carbs, 2 proteins, and 0 sugars. So that's pretty good because I do make a sugar free pudding gel, uh, excuse me, sugar free pudding cookies with Bisquick. So I thought this would much be a much healthier choice. And it says it makes all kinds of stuff. You can make pancakes, uh, all kinds of stuff with this. Uh, pot pie, uh, crusts, all kinds of stuff. Just like Bisquick. Uh, the next thing, oh, this was seven dollars and seventy nine cents, so it's not very cheap. So this is like maybe every, every six months or so type of thing for me. And the next thing is cup uh, meals in a cup. Uh, the first one is macaroni and cheese, and these are three dollars and ninety nine cents. Um, this is what it looks like. So maybe you know, like a you know, like a convenient lunch or dinner. And the stats on here is pretty good. Um, they said this has one serving, 148 calories, uh, 66 from fat. Uh, I think I'm reading that right. Um, three net carbs, 18 proteins, and zero sugar. Yeah, three net carbs. Yeah, that would be right. And I also got the spaghetti version as well. And somebody told me these are really good. You just add water to them, and like, and these are just three ninety nine each. And the next Dixie Diner product I got was um, the Sweet Maple Instant Hot Cereal. So I thought this would be good in the in the winter time. Um, the stats on here, I'll, I'll show you what it looks like. Um, there's five packages in here, and it came out to four dollars and fifty nine cents. So maybe a dollar ten or a dollar twenty per serving, and there's five in here, a little envelopes, and ninety calories, um, three net carbs, zero sugars, and twelve proteins. So some of the stuff is low carb with high protein. So that's pretty good. Um, and their motto is um, on the back up here, and also on their website. Um, Health food that tastes like junk food. That's what the motto is, the logo or, or saying is. I, I would recommend checking their website out first because they have tons and tons of stuff that you can get uh, to read. Now, I did order two Walden Farms products because uh, I'm going to give these another. Uh, I'm going to give another product a try. I did not like the Honey Dijon, but I did like the Ranch. And I got the Caramel Dip. For, for my apples, uh, this was three ninety nine, and this is the Walden Farms caramel dip. And Walden Farms is zero calories, zero fat, uh, zero sugars, zero everything except the sodium because it's caramel. And uh, this was three ninety nine, so I'm gonna give this a try. 
And also, I ordered Walden Farms Chipotle Mayo. And this is what it looks like. And this was also $3.99. And everything else is zero, zero, zero except the sodium. I think, I think in Walden Farms products, everything is zero except the sodium. Because that's, I guess that's what it gives it the taste. And I ordered this as well. Um, Slender Sticks Tropical Fruit Punch Drink Mix. Uh, it has vitamins in it as well. And it's just 10 calories and it's sugar free. And this is made with uh, Stevia, I think. Yeah, Stevia. Uh, I, I mixed it up. And at first I didn't like it. A couple more sips. It was okay. I, I would give it an 8. But to tell you the truth, I would not spend my money on it again. I mean, it was okay, but I prefer my my crushed drink mixes better. But it has 10 calories, uh, 9 daily vitamins, and fiber. So this is what it looks like. And my order came to $40.87 with the $4.95 shipping um, for that. Oh, also, I forgot about this. Um, uh, Nutrition also carries another zero-calorie product line called Green Valley Ranch. Uh, that's the name of the company, Green Valley Ranch. And I got the Caesar dressing. And the reason why I saw this online, like it was pictured, and it looks like it has lots of seasoning in it compared to the Walden Farms. The well, Walden Farms didn't look like it has any kind of seasonings in it. And it's also everything zero, zero calories, zero fat, um, zero carb, zero sugars, zero protein. And just like the Walden Farms, they do have some sodium in it. But this actually looks better. I don't know if you got if y'all can tell, it does have like seasonings in it. And the uh, Walden Farms didn't look like it did because I did see the Caesar dressing at the store and it didn't look like it. So I'm gonna give that a try. Um, I'm gonna show you my syrups now. Now these three syrups came from Davinci themselves. Um, one was out of stock with Nutrition, so I didn't order with them, and Da Vinci had free shipping, so it, the price came to the same conclusion, uh, same calculation, but I just ordered from Da Vinci because they do have what I was looking for. Uh, this is the B52 flavor. Uh, they say this was supposed to taste like uh, mixed with Kalula and ice cream and the hint of orange. That's what this flavor is supposed to be. And these are sugar free. Uh, these are $7.99 each. I got three of them from Da Vinci. And I think all their sugar free versions are made with Splenda. So any other people who have problems with aspartame, this, will, this is a good choice for you. And on here, they do have a servings. Um, uh, what they recommend for you to do, like in coffee, on um, the back, like one and a half ounce for coffee, lattes, one full ounce, Italian soda, one full ounce, lemonade or iced tea, one full ounce. And this is the B52. These are glass, so you got to be careful. Another one I ordered from there was the Delucci uh, De Lucci syrup. It's supposed to be like the, I think, the Mexican flavor caramel. This is what it looks like. Everything on these are zero except the sodium. And I also ordered the butter rum syrup. Sugar free, everything I got is sugar free. Now, this one, I was looking for this, and this also came from Da Vinci. It is the Kahlua flavor sugar free syrup, and this is non alcoholic, so it's just the flavoring. And on here, everything's zero except the sodium, so I think it's just the sodium that they make it flavor. Um, I th no, I take that back. The butter rum came from Lolly Cup. I, I put them all in one box uh, to make it br easier to bring it in here. The rest are the Chitrani syrups I got from Lolly Cup. And Lolly Cup syrups, they can range from 4 to $5, so they're cheaper. 
but you do get your price break um, when you order four or more. Um, at yeah, you get the price break at four versus net nutrition because they do charge for shipping. So you order four, the price you get your price break and it's cheaper in order for nutrition. Uh, I got the sugar-free almond roca. And these are also made by Splenda. Irish cream. Uh, all, um, yeah, yeah, sugar-free. They should be sugar-free. Uh, pumpkin pie. Um, Texas Mom 2011 ordered a whole bunch of these, and she said the pumpkin pie is pretty good. You just put a couple drops in it make in your protein shake. And I like pumpkin pie, and the story behind that is, uh, Target, where I live, is they have a Starbucks inside the Target store. It's a super Target. And like around, right before Thanksgiving or right after Halloween, uh, the girl was walking around the store and giving free samples out of the pumpkin pie flavor uh, frappuccinos. And it was just like itty bitty little one ounce cup. So I took a taste of it. And I said, well, well, that's pretty good. But do you have any sugar free version? They said they don't. But she was telling me the key is if you kind of worry about the sugars, let tell them to do it real light. Uh, and that and makes it better tasting. So that I'm going to give this a try because this is sugar free. Put that in my protein shakes. Uh peanut butter. I'm not really a big peanut butter fan, um, but I did like the uh, peanut butter bar I did a review on, so I'm going to give this a try and see if I, if I like a hint of it in my protein shakes. And like I said, all these are made with Splenda, I believe. The other one is white chocolate. And the last one is French vanilla. I'm going to see if this French vanilla tastes any different from the regular version vanilla. I don't know. Some people say, yeah, they can tell. Some people, they can't. And so I'm going to give them a try. And I will post the links from the companies I ordered from. If you have any questions, let me know. If, or if you have any comments, just post them below or just private message me. Talk to you later. And I'm going to, I know I forgot to let you know, I'm going to do product reviews on these Dixie Diner and Walden Farms products and uh, try to do reviews on these syrups as well. So stay tuned for those products because I'm going to let you know if these are good or bad. Uh, trust me, if they're bad, I'm going to let you know if I know because um, I'm a believer. You know, if it's not very good, stay away.